So one thing I've noticed is that whenever I get a haircut, which I did last week, as you may have noticed, people start assuming that I lost my leg in a rock, uh, which is really awkward because total strangers come up to me and they're like really serious, right? And they're like, thank you for your service to America. And it's like really awkward because I'm, I'm afraid if I tell them I had cancer, it's going to be just such a letdown, you know, like, oh, cancer, it's so unpatriotic, jeez. All right, because if people are, they're so excited, as they should be, because they, th they think they're meeting, you know, a genuine hero, right? Someone who, uh, who made a sacrifice for our freedom. Uh, and, and so I'm afraid that if I tell them that I didn't uh, do that for them, it's, it's, it's just, it's a letdown. It's like telling a child that Santa Claus doesn't exist or something, you know? And, and, and the first time this ever happened to me, I was so caught off guard uh, by this guy who was literally just like, thank you for your service to America. It, it means a lot. Freedom isn't free. You know, he's just going on and on. And I was so taken back that I didn't know what to say and I didn't want to let him down. So I was just like, got really serious and I was like, you know what? It was an honor. <laughs> and like, yeah, I mean, I'm not trying to take credit for stuff I didn't do, but I just, I didn't know what else to say, you know? Um, but I was, I was telling that story uh, like last year at a speech and I was talking to a group of uh, teenagers with disabilities, some physical disabilities and some mental disabilities. And afterwards, this girl came up to me and she was like, hey, you know, when you were talking about people losing their leg in a rocket and, you know, you said that thing about Santa Claus not being real. And I looked over and there was a bunch of, of kids with like developmental disabilities and they were like 16 but I think they started crying. Like, I don't, I don't think they knew. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> that is, I am a terrible, terrible person. I can never tell that story again. So if you're watching this, um, hopefully you already knew. Uh, geez, this is, this is bad. I should not post this. Because there's probably little children out there that watch my videos. Hopefully not. If you're a child, we shouldn't be on YouTube. YouTube has terrible things. You should be watching, if you're on YouTube, you should only be watching The Sneezing Panda over and over all day. That's all you can see. And also that chipmunk that's like, you know, that video. Those are the only things you should see if you are that young. Don't be watching my videos. Anyway, hey, Merry Christmas. Thanks for watching.